how can something like this programming cause such a fuss, even being banned in school districts around the country? It could be dangerous. It could, it might make people more lazy. And now in the high school division of the 2023 Hikino on PBS Hawaii Winter Challenge. Coming in second place is Hilo High School on Hawaii Island. Congratulations. With the rise of AI development, new platforms like ChatGPT by OpenAI have surged in global use, allowing for new opportunities and obstacles to surface in the classroom. ChatGPT. 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 But what is ChatGPT? ChatGPT, in its own words, is a computer program that can understand and generate written language. As of now, it can write stories, answer a wide variety of questions, translate, summarize texts, or even participate in conversations similar to that of people talking. However, the views on its usage are deeply mixed. It could be dangerous. School purposes, I would say it is a positive. Fascinating, a little frightening. But how can something like this programming cause such a fuss, even being banned in school districts around the country? It can do a lot, so I played around with uh, writing poetry and personal statements about my goals. I tried to put in a poem and the personal statement into the um, something that tells you whether or not it's written by a human or a computer, and it was not able to tell. It could be dangerous. It could. It might make people more lazy. I would be hesitant to talk about it. It would have to be, I think, a conversation would have to um, take place in the classroom to talk about ethics and honesty and what the students thought of it. Maybe uh, go back to paper pencil assignments. I believe the most furthest that a teacher went would be to transition all of our homework from online to in paper because of my English teacher, she went from putting all of our information and our homework on Google Docs to worksheets simply because she fears that if we use ChatGPT, we can easily rewrite it. I don't think ChatGPT is very useful in a classroom. You'll simply be getting the answers immediately, and that goes against the entire reason why you're in school in the first place. I think it's a positive because of the amount of information you're able to access within such a short limited of time. So how should schools determine the usage of ChatGPT? both sides and to understand um, uh, how it's being used and how it can be used effectively. And like any tool or resource, it, it really depends on how it's used. So assuming students are using it to support writing and critical thinking and artificial intelligence helps students to do that, then, um, then again, it's a tool to be and a resource to be used. This is Clara Steele from Hilo High School for Hiki no on PBS Hawaii.